What's going on guys? Today I'll be going over an actual Red Dead Redemption 2 money glitch slash exploit. So this is like a legitimate like kind of glitch that I'm sure Rockstar will have to patch because it's it's basically just a way to get a whole lot of money very quickly. So in order to do this glitch, you're gonna wanna head over to Braithwaite Manor and there's actually quite a few glitches in this manor. I kind of like was trying this area out just simply because it's a huge area in the story mode that like has a lot of valuables in it so i kind of assumed it would be similar in the online so basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to head to where i am right here on the map near like the entrance towards the main mansion area and this glitch is really weird i don't know why it works like this but it basically involves just continually respawning jewelry that you can pick up and obviously just go sell to a fence so once you walk in the manor here you're going to want to go either in here and pick up something just a random object that's not like a piece of jewelry like there's some fine brandy over here and i actually picked up some rum that was on this table over here but it doesn't really matter what you pick up and then if you actually go up the stairs so straight up these stairs right here and to the left right here there's some jewelry sitting right here and for whatever reason if you pick up an item pick up the jewelry leave the house and come back it will just continue to spawn but in order for you to uh, or for in order for the uh, jewelry to actually respawn you actually kind of go have to go a little bit away um, from the house but it's literally only like 10 feet like it's not it takes about 30 seconds so I usually go right around in front of this like main entrance way turn back around here and then just go back in and keep taking the jewelry so this is just like the simplest exploit that i have seen by far in order to get more uh, money super quickly and when you come in for the second time or the third time or whatever uh, you don't have to keep grabbing random items but for whatever reason this jewelry just keeps respawning like, as you can see it's here again and you can just very very easily get i mean hundreds of pieces of jewelry within minutes i mean it, it takes what 10 seconds to do this i could actually try to time it if you guys wanted but this is super, super easy to do. I have yet to see one actual money exploit as good as this, uh, because this is literally you getting potentially hundreds and hundreds of dollars just very, very quickly, because all of the pieces of jewelry, they're somewhat random, I've seen some of them being very good and some of them kind of poor. Like some of them are only a dollar, but some of them are upwards of like five, ten dollars. So it really kind of depends what kind of jewelry you get. But once again, guys, this is just a super, super easy exploit that is uh, just one of the most basic ones I have ever seen. And you can easily, easily just continue, continue to get money. But anyways, I'm probably going to fast forward here and kind of just go along and just show you guys how, uh, how much money I can get in like a very, very short amount of time. And another nice thing about this method is that there's actually a fence very, very close by in roads. So if you just simply run up to roads up here in this corner, you'll like automatically see it. There's actually a fence up there that uh, you can sell your stuff to very, very quickly. And while I'm riding over there, one thing I did notice though, I accidentally hit one of the guards and then all of the guards started attacking me. So that would definitely, definitely um, be a problem and it actually kind of messes up um, the way that uh, the glitch works. So if that happens to you, I'd probably, um, you know, you can kill the guards or whatever and then I would probably recommend leaving the lobby and then coming back after that. But anyways, right here, I'm going to ride to uh, road real quick and sell the jewelry and see how much I actually get for it. And as you can see here, I'm now in uh, by the fence or whatever. And once you actually go up to them and sell it, you can actually sell all this stuff for a pretty decent amount and make a lot of money for it. But other than that, guys, that's really it for this glitch slash exploit. I'm sure Red Dead will probably patch it pretty soon. So make sure you do this one kind of quick. But other than that, guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did, definitely leave a like and subscribe for more content.